Hey, it's Gabe with Vitev with some thoughts on acid water. So you've probably seen those lists or had somebody tell you about all these great things that you can use that wastewater stream, you know, the water that just typically runs down your drain, uh, that you should capture that and you can, you can then use it on your body, on your hair, on your skin, um, bug bites, sunburn, all sorts of things, right? Rashes. Um, and it's a way to take a negative, which is a ton of water and money heading down your drain and turn it into a positive and make it something that you can get benefits from, right? Well, there's a couple issues with that. One really, really bad issue, which I'll tell you shortly. But, but the first one is there's a lot of water. It's about a 60-40 ratio that those ionizers create. So 60% heads into that, the drinking stream and 40% heads into that waste stream. So if you figure you're gonna make a gallon of water, maybe two gallons of water a day, well, for every gallon you create to drink, you're gonna end up with about three quarters of a gallon of wastewater, which is a lot of water. You're not gonna use that much water externally on your body every day. And what you end up with is gallons and gallons of water stored for, I don't know what, you can't drink it. Um, you, you only spray so much on your body at one time, you can only rinse your hair so many times, right? Before you don't need it anymore. So what you really need is just a little bit of a, a little bit, a few ounces every day and you'll be fine. So no matter what, you're gonna be pouring a ton of water down the drain. But the second issue is the one that's more significant. Um, and when we realized this years ago, uh, it was sort of shocking. Okay, so you have all that water runs into an ionizer, right? 100% through that tube. You have a, just a very basic carbon filter for the most part on that ionizer, unless you spend several hundred dollars more for a, a high-end pre-filtration system, which most people don't. Um, it's already, you're, you're already dropping four or 5,000. That's enough, right? You don't need to spend a couple hundred more for a filter. So um, you're stuck with this, this, this stock filter that comes in the system, which doesn't filter very well at all. You have a whole lot of toxins and contaminants and just nasty stuff still in the water. So where do those things go? I mean, you only have two choices. It either goes to the alkaline stream and into the drinking glass or the acid stream and down the drain. Now, if it's going down the drain, that's fine, right? Because it's no big deal. You're not going to worry about it. It's heading out the wastewater and never see it again. But if you're capturing it, and you're spraying it on yourself, or you're soaking your hair in it, or your feet, or whatever, well, that's a problem, right? Because we're told that only the good stuff goes into your glass, and all the bad stuff goes down the drain. I mean, we'll just leave that alone for right now. Just assume that's true. Well, now you've concentrated it. You've taken 100% of those toxins, and you've put it into 40% of the water. And now you're taking that water, and you're spraying it on your face. So it's not a good option. So what's a better way to achieve all those same benefits? Well, something like this, actually. A bottle of water from the local grocery store uh, or 50 cent gallon you fill jugs you know at the water store as well that's the best way to do it it has the same ph properties as the that wastewater will you're going to have the same you know benefits to the to the body because of that ph naturally matching what our our external ph is you're going to have a positive orp which is also good but most importantly that water is clean those systems at the store the bottles that you buy are all very highly filtered. I mean, just stay away from the one that, that just simply says municipal water supply. Don't use that kind. Use something that's got really high levels of filtration, reverse osmosis and UV lights, and, and it says it on the label. When you do that, you get all of the benefits without all of those toxins going on your skin as well. And you're gonna spend, what, a dollar a week maybe for water? So it's a better, it's a cheaper, it's a, um, a more cost-effective, it's a simpler way to achieve all those same benefits. and. Those are all things that we value here at Vitev. So I hope that helps. Let us know if you have any questions. You can drop us a comment down below or give us a call or live chat. That works just fine as well. And we look forward to talking with you soon.